Hey, Internet, guess who decided to stop in today? It's Keenan Kale. Oh, hey, Keenan Kale, what's up? Hey, what's going on? So, everybody knows you for your Lip Dub videos. M millions of people. Yeah. <laughs> How, but here, you're here in New York now to record your own music. Yeah. So, what can we expect? What's that like? Do you know it's like dance and you slash top 40? Oh, okay. So, um, you know, it's, you know, really cool to finally actually make my own music instead of, you know, lip, some, lip syncing someone else's. So who are you in the studio with while you're here? Um, it's actually just me. Just um, you. Cool. It's, it's kind of, I, I think it's kind of like your own thing in the studio, like, do what you want to do, because it's kind of like the creative process of making your own sound and your own kind of little things. Do you feel comfortable when you're in the studio, or are you like, I can't believe that I'm here, what's going on? Um, I mean, at first I was kind of just like, how do I put, like, emotions into it? Because it's a different, it's basically way different than, you know, lip syncing. Um, yeah, yep. <laughs> but I mean, it was, um, I think like the lip syncing actually helped a little bit, so now I kind of feel more how to put emotions in like my voice when I'm singing. You've already made a ton of videos with a bunch of different famous musicians. You yeah. know, we've got Katy Perry, everybody's seen the 50 Cent video, um, LMFAO. Are any of those people gonna make guest appearances? Anybody you've worked with before? Um, I mean, I'm definitely doing like uh, videos now of me just singing. Mm -hmm. So, um, and you know, we just did a video with uh, Cheyenne Jackson. Okay. Um, which, people who don't know, he's from, you know, like um, Broadway and 30 Rock and Glee and stuff like that. Um, and then we're going to Kansas City to record, um, not record, but uh, shoot with um, Gavin DeGraw. Okay. So, he uh, he actually is just like, yeah, no, I like his singing and everything like that. Let's. Let's hook, let's hook something up here. Is it tough to be going to school and trying to get all your stuff done and also making videos at home? I, I mean, it's it's a little weird because like, yeah, it's just like, you know, one day I'm at, you know, I'm at in Vegas with like LMFAO performing and then you get, and then you go back to school on Monday. It's just and like, you have like a Spanish test. Like, and it's just like, yeah, this is weird. <laughs> it seems like you know everybody in the music business. Um, so what has been the most like hilarious thing that happened behind the scenes with any of these people? Um, I remember- Hilarious or awkward, whichever. Um, it was weird because we, when we did 50 Cent, we had uh, two songs. All of a sudden he makes himself cry. And you can just see it like the tears going down his face and it's a little like, okay, <laughs> that's so, like, that's awesome how you can do that, but it's a little weird. <laughs> so were you just sitting here like, Oh my God! I made Fiddy cry. Or? Well, no, he was he was making himself cry to look make sure. it look emotional because this guy <laughs> trying to be like an emotional song and he just, just made himself cry. Okay, so real talk. What has been the best thing about your like newfound fame, and also what has been the weirdest thing about it? Um, I do have weird people like tweeting me. Oh, I believe creepy it. Stuff. <laughs> what type of thing are you getting from people? Um, I've had um. A, per, uh, a girl from Brazil who actually changed their last name to like Cahill. Okay, now that's not so much a weird tweet as an awesome tweet. No, it's it's creepy because then she's <laughs> and then there's like another one from like France who's just like, can I have his uh, address? And these are manager, ladies who are just like. Well, my man, my manager's like no. He's, she's just like, well, I don't understand. Like she's going all nuts. Like I don't get. I just love him. And I just want to like send him things. It's like. No, it's the reason why I don't, I'm not giving you my address, so you don't kill me. Well, Keenan, it was so great to meet you. Thank you so much for stopping by. Thank you for having me. And good luck on your new music. I'm so excited to hear it.